You don't really know much about Halloween. Alright, and welcome back to another unboxing video. I am your host, Joel. I am one half of the Newly Deads. And on this uh, episode, we are slowly getting through all of the things I bought at the... But before I get into that, if you're not familiar with the Newly Deads, uh, just go to thenewlydeads.com. You can find out, um, you know, any events that we're going to be at as we are artists. You can go check us out there, meet us in person, say hello, see what we have to offer. Uh, we also write two blogs, uh, one each. We also have a uh, podcast version of our television show. We have a television show, which is available through multiple different uh, avenues that you can check out, as well as a ton of other YouTube content and a lot of other fun stuff there if you want to know more about us. On that site, there also is our email address. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns, you can reach us at contact at thenewlydeads.com. We would be happy to get back to you as soon as we get your message. So let us know what you got on your mind. In this instance, one of these is a boutique label uh, that I found a better deal on than on through them directly. I don't know how that happens. And then uh, the other one is one that is a major wide release. But anyway, uh, the first thing we have here is, hey folks, it's intermission time, the video party, or intermission time video party. It's it's a long title. Hey folks, it's the intermission time video party. It's a long one. Um, that's what she said. Anyway, <laughs> this is uh, Mike Franey's passion project, which uh, it, it basically began as a um, thing in the 90s where he um, wanted to celebrate kind of his love for drive-ins and, uh, you know, scouring various video sources and things like that to um, try and track down just some of the odds and ends things that you would find, little, um, you know, nostalgic trips back in time, things that would be at the beginning or whatever during the drive-in, um, you know, commercial type things. And <clears throat> so what he did was he collected them into six different volumes of this series and um then he also did a or they did a supercut for this which is a 79 minute uh collection of the all the six titles into one cohesive kind of i don't want to call it a narrative per se but um it, so basically it's a lot of weird clips that are strung together in six different volumes and then one ultimate kind of best of i guess is the best way to put it but it just sounds like, you know, a, a kind of a fun time, not something you would just necessarily sit down and watch, but maybe, you know, if you have a short attention span or if you put it on in the background, if you're having a party or something like that, and you have folks that uh, are into this sort of thing, which not everybody is. Uh, oh, I forgot there was a second disc behind it, which looks the same as the first disc. Um, <clears throat> then there is a small little card here that kind of explains what we've got going on. It just sounded like a good time, and I'm always up for something that's a little weird, and uh, AF AGFA is kind of uh, notorious for having kind of the best of the best in terms of like kind of the fringe stuff, and uh, this is also, as you can see, is a Something Weird video, which Something Weird has been around forever, um, and so again, another title that is known for having something outside of the mainstream, and something that not everybody is going to have in their collection so this one i'm excited to check out don't know what to expect but we will find out soon enough uh the second thing that i got uh was this is uh the tom baker complete series four now this is the numbering based off of uh the individual doctor so each individual doctor is getting their own set and rather than give the actual numbering for where it fell in the time that since the series started in 1963 they are labeling each series based on, uh, you know, which series it is for this particular doctor. So in this case, the fourth doctor, this is his fourth series. Help clear that up. Um, so these are six stories from the 1977 uh, series of Doctor Who, which my introduction to uh, Doctor Who was in about 1984 through Tom Baker and Peter Davidson. I consider Tom to be my first doctor. So these are uh, some of my 
you know, favorite episodes. Uh, I have the entire collection so far of these. Uh, if you get them on a sale, you can get them fairly inexpensive if you are like me and you don't want to take a chance missing and you buy them uh, as soon as they come out, then you pay a little bit more of a premium price. But that way I ensure that I have them all. Not that they've gone out of print, but I don't want to take any chances. Um, this series is the one that introduced the world to canine, which depending on your perspective on that uh, could be a positive or a negative. Um, canine went on to have his own series. He went on to uh, adventures on his own with Sarah Jane and um, is a popular, of course, with the kids. And then he had anyway, faith. that is all for this one. It's a short and sweet. I just wanted to give you kind of a um, I've got a, a large amount of stuff. So there's going to be a lot of videos that are going to be popping up. I don't know where this one is going to fall in line in terms of when it's released versus the other ones, but um, there's a lot more to come. So stay tuned to this channel. Um, if you would like to check out our other unboxing videos or other content, um, just click on the links wherever they are. I don't know where they end up in the in this the page here. My ignorance, I guess. Anyway, thank you so much. Uh, don't forget that nothing in life is guaranteed, so don't forget to unbox your heart. I'll see you next time. The dead might be looking at Halloween, the festival of Sauron. Happy Halloween.